today we are going to discuss today we are going to discuss the concept of bappy okay today we are going to discuss the concept of bappy bappy means what uh, what is the bappy bappy is nothing but say business application business application programming programming interface bappy is nothing but bappy is a business application programming interface bappy is nothing but say bappy is a business application programming interface okay what is the main purpose of the bappy what is the main purpose of the bappy okay what is the main purpose of the bappy anybody have the idea do you people have any idea about the bappy if you have any idea please send a message Okay. Yeah. Actually, BAP is the, the full form of the BAP is nothing but it's a business application programming interface. For example, I have, see, I have IBM client. This IBM client asked me, Anil Krishna, okay, Anil Krishna, there is a one, see, there is a one SAP system in India. And there is another SAP system in Australia. There is another SAP system in Australia. Okay. You please try to send the data from Indian SAP system to Australian SAP system. Or else, okay, my client asked me, Anil Krishna, I have a notepad. I have a notepad. This notepad having some information, for example, bank information. This notepad having some bank information. Okay. This notepad having some bank information. You please try to send the notepad data into the Australian SAP system. How we people can send? What is the main purpose of the BAPI? With the help of the BAPI, we people can send the data from SAP to SAP, SAP to non-SAP. That means non-SAP to SAP, SAP to SAP, we people can send. And if you want to use, okay, if you want to see, instead of this BAPI, we people will provide the RFC. Instead of the BAPI, we people see, we people convert this BAP, okay, we people, Okay, we people will convert this BAPI when we add in when when we add RFC functionality inside of this one. Okay, and uh, one more thing, you see, actually BAPI is nothing but BAPI is a BAPI is just like a function module, just like a BAPI is nothing but it's a BAPI is just like a function module. BAPI is nothing but BAPI is just like a function module. <clears throat> okay, BAPI is nothing but BAPI is just like a function module, but it is not function module. BAPI is just like a function module, but it is not function module. But it is not function module. Okay, BAPI is a function, BAPI is, BAPI is just like a function module, but it is not exact function module. This BAPI will works like a BAPI. It looks like a BAPI, it's sorry. This BAPI looks like a function module. It will act like a function module, but it is not exact function module. Okay, I'll tell you the difference between the function, normal function module and BAPI. See, if we come to the normal function module, we people can use the normal function module for general purpose, to get the data, to display the data, to process the data. But here, for general purpose, we people are going to use. But BAPI, by using the BAPI, we people can send the data, from one desk, one, so one from notepad to SAP or SAP to SAP, we people can send. But through the function module, it's not possible. Through the function module, it's not possible. Okay. And actually, see here, in a BAP, we have mainly two types of BAPIs. In a BAP, mainly we have two types of BAPIs. The first one is, first one is standard. First one is standard BAPI. And the second one is a custom BAPI. First one is standard BAPI. And the second one is a custom BAPI. First one is standard BAPI. First one is standard BAPI. And the second one is a custom BAPI. Standard BAPI means what? Uh, if the BAPIs were created by SAP Labs, if the BAPIs were if the BAPIs were created by SAP Labs, which BAPIs were already created by the SAP Labs, 
which map is created by the SAP labs. Those VAPs are the standard VAPs. If the evapor create any VAPI, if the evapor create, evapor means what you are the evapor, I am the evapor, whatever the VAPI, whatever the VAPI is created to start creating in our project, those VAPIs are the custom VAPIs. Okay. And see, we'll see this, we'll discuss about this custom VAPI in tomorrow's class. Today we are going to discuss about the standard VAPI. Today, I'm going to discuss about the standard VAPI. Who see who will uh, who will decide? See who will do this standard VAPI? Who will do this standard VAPI? SAP Labs. Who will who will who will design who designed and developed this standard VAPI? SAP Labs. If the SAP Labs are developed, if they SAP Labs, if they if the SAP Labs are developed any VAPI. If the SAP labs are developed any VAPI, that is called standard VAPI. If the evapor developed any VAPI, that is called custom VAPI. Okay. <clears throat> okay. See, SAP labs were introduced to in the entire see in the entire see totally. That means uh, totally means uh, the entire SAP. We have SAP labs. We have uh, more than two thousand standard VAPIs. Till now, SAP Labs introduced more than 2,000 standard VAPIs. Till now, for all modules in SAP, we have different different modules. For all those modules, so SAP Labs introduced more than 2,000 standard VAPIs. I'll show you those things, right?